Hello, Walter McCone here. Um, on the 22nd to 24th of March 2018, I'll be giving a presentation for Pantorea in the Netherlands. All the information will accompany this video. And this will be on osteopathic approach to evolution and advanced manipulative approach to treatment. So why evolution? Well, actually, Andrew Taylor Steele wanted to name his new science after the grand theory of the time. And of course, that was evolution back in the 19th century. And this evolution wasn't uh, sort of Charles Darwin evolution. Um, it was Alfred Russell Wallace and Herbert Spencer. Now, why Alfred Russell Wallace in particular? Well, Wallace had a more of a spiritual approach towards um, evolution. Now, by spiritual, we mean meaningfulness. That means sort of person-centered, not, um, not uh, the sort of mechanical approach of Charles Darwin. And because of this, he also looked to the work of people like uh, Henry David Thoreau. Now, Thoreau looked at the death of animals in, uh, in Walden um, and found, or realised, that um, the last tissue that's left is bone. So therefore, that tissue must be the closest tissue to nature. So it's in looking at the bones as the slowest form of movement. Now, not while looking look at the bones, not look at the joints, but actually looking at the shape or form or essence of the bones. What that means is that osteopathic movement is actually in the bones or of the bones. Um, short bones are for stopping, long bones are for moving faster and so on and so on. So this whole approach to evolution is where I've seen one human being showing itself differently, not uh, multiple. So there was an underlying treatment approach which was based on the fact that you should treat at a basis, as a basic principle, every patient the same, but then you treat differently because of individual patients. And this sameness means we can see this movement. Now, to see this movement means that it allows you to, to palpate it through perception. So we have to have a special mode of consciousness. So evolution shows us the movement um, on a historical basis, which is obviously evolution, an unfolding of the embryo, which is what evolution actually means, as opposed to involution, which is infolding. Now, what we're going to do is palpate this movement. Now, to palpate this movement, we have to come into more of a process thinking approach rather than a sort of outside in approach, looking at the patient as an object. It actually starts with you. So we actually go backwards in our thinking, not forwards. So we're going to go through all this, the theory, um, how this is done, why this is done, and how to palpate. Now this is why it's called advanced manipulation, because advanced manipulation doesn't mean more techniques or more complexity of techniques. It's about deepening the experience in the osteopath, so they can actually palpate in an intuitive manner, because A.T. Still was always going about the, what makes the difference is this intuitive approach. That's not intellectual, that's not thinking, as in being aware of what's in your hands. We need to back up because we're in the same world as the patient we're treating. So to deepen the experience in, in the osteopath based on evolution or unfolding of the osteopath, in, uh, unfolding of the patient of the osteopath, the unfolding of the patient because we're, all, we're in evolution now and our form demonstrates that unfolding. So this is what the whole course is going to be on. We're going to start with the history of evolution, <clears throat> different kinds of evolution. Um, how we interpret evolution, how we interpret the form or shape of ourselves, and how to interpret this movement, not again through intellectualism, but through intuitivism. And our palpation is going to be advanced because it goes from a kind of understanding. And once you understand what you're palpating, that leads to meaning, making it meaningfulness, and that leads to you making the right judgment in all the relationships of tissue, particularly in bone. So, I hope to see you there on the 22nd to 24th of March 2018 at Pantare. Have a great day.